Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're doing well today. I have brought this guy. Hey. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so for those who haven't tuned into this channel before, this is my husband. His name is Dan. My name is Anne. And we are going to do a part two of a get to know us. Especially since we did the first one when I was... Okay, when I was <laughs> when I was pregnant, so I wanted to do this now after the fact, um, just to see if there's been some changes and some answers. Let's do it. <laughs> so if you watched the first video, I remember asking this question: How many kids do you want? And he answered four. Hmm. So now I'm gonna ask this question again: How many kids do you want, Dan? Um. <laughs> Thinking maybe two. Really? Two or three. Okay. Why did it drop from uh, four to two? Kids are more work than you'd expect. No, we all knew there were work. More work than I expected. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm with him. I always wanted three children, but I'm like, you know, depending on what we have for the second child, I think that might be it, but we'll see. That'll be a decision that we make later on, but I thought that was really funny watching over that. So he's like, four kids. I'm like, yeah, okay. Wishful thinking. <laughs> I know it's been a while, but how was the birthing experience for you? If you could just sum it up, because like I know how it was like for me, but you, <laughs> how was it for you? Felt like I was in a state of shock for like 24 hours <laughs> when I looked back and I was just trying to be supportive and, and present. Yeah, I don't know, like that's, the best way to explain it was like state of shock like what is happening i can't believe this is really happening mm -hmm. and then that first four days oh man was a bl <laughs> Ooh. i think we slept like less than 10 hours in four days it was rough and i remember because i ended up having a c-section so we're at the hospital and the nurses god bless them they're amazing but they were coming in every 30 minutes <laughs> it wasn't so it wasn't I, 30 minutes but it felt like it so if you fall asleep <laughs> they come in they turn the lights on they check and it's like whoa and then the second night they literally came with a sheet saying the second night is one of the worst mm -hmm. and i was like oh that's nice to know <laughs> um but yeah so the birth sorry the, the birthing experience was stressful yeah or and sorry. i can't imagine how it was for you because you were dealing with the pain of a c-section you know being a new mom just no sleep <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of things um yeah shout out to mom seriously i did put out a video after the fact but it was very it was, it was a very interesting experience for sure and i feel like it was a, a blur now it's just yeah i can't believe it's been like we're going on a year and a half it's wild yeah it's weird is being a parent what you expected? Yes or no? How if not? I don't really have a ton of expectations. Yeah. Kind of just went into it open-minded. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's definitely, if you don't have kids, it's more time consuming than you would imagine. Or maybe you would imagine it's time consuming, but it, yeah, that, that little person becomes your, your entire life. And mm -hmm. like, you realize that before you had kids, life was all about you and your partner and then very quickly it, the whole your whole world becomes that child yeah um so if you're a very selfish person i suggest <laughs> not having children <laughs> <laughs> or at least wait so for me i'm kind of the same i always go into things where i'm like if i've never been through it i don't really set expectations because i don't know what to expect because i've never been through it so like him i went in with an open mind i think i took it like as a learning experience like you know I'm learning him, he's learning me, we're learning how to be parents, like it's just a growing and learning experience, so that's how mm -hmm. I went into it without like much expectations. I, I obviously knew like, you know, there's a late nights, there's a tired, but like there's nothing quite like it. Remember, I don't know what week it was, but I don't know what was happening and I was just crying. All the time. And Dan's like, what is happening? <laughs> It's like, what do I do? I'm like, I don't know what's wrong with and me. And as a, as a precursor to that, Anne's not an overly emotional person generally. I think I've seen her cry up until that point, just a handful <laughs> of times in the, I don't know, eight or nine years we've been together. Also found out that was just hormones. Um, they're trying to stabilize in your body. So they just wreak havoc and you just cry. And I'm like, oh, wonderful, <laughs> wonderful. But no, it, it's definitely been an experience. But, mm -hmm. you know, taking a good day at a time. It's been amazing. Yeah, and he's a really great, great partner. Great husband. Yeah, <laughs> great husband. 
Hey, you're my partner too. Partner in crime. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to do on your downtime? Like sports. Okay. Yeah. Like I'm... watching them or playing them? Both. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, right now, the Masters is on. Oh my goodness. Day one, Tiger Woods, minus he one. He is the guy that watches golf. And hockey. Yes, fine, but golf. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I will sit there. He's so cute, he gets so excited. <laughs> yeah, I love golf, love hockey. Those are my two fun things to do. Yeah. And when I'm not, yeah, when I'm not playing them, if there's a good tournament on or a good hockey game, I enjoy watching that. I don't... Like, I wish I had something like that. Like, I don't... I feel like he's very passionate about even, like, playing or watching golf and hockey. I don't really have anything. Netflix, maybe? I think for me, I just really enjoy shutting my brain off. And usually it has to do with watching something. I'm slowly getting into reading. Shout out to my little book club. Dan does not watch the things that I watch. He does. I like, I like, like, Supernatural, like unrealistic things and he does things well, that aren't real i just like watching well, i don't know we watch shows together right now we're on season eight of one tree hill if oh, you yeah. haven't watched it make sure to watch it it's a classic <laughs> it's my first time watching it <laughs> this is my seventh <laughs> kind of he's been asking me to watch this for so long um oh our child is coming carter's roaming the house by himself i know he's at that age oh <laughs> Come in. Come on, bud. Say hey, hi. Say hi. Can you give a wave? <laughs> <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> okay, so what do you do for work? I was in sales for 14 years. And about six or seven years ago, I uh, started buying real estate. Uh, so now I've left that, the sales. And now... We have uh, a few small businesses that surround real estate. Currently I'm on mat leave, but uh, before that I was working as an auditor at a, um, an accounting firm. I actually really enjoyed it. It was actually, it was, it was kind of fun. Obviously it's very stressful and like, you know, people don't really like auditors very much. So you have to navigate <laughs> through that. Uh, yeah, that's what I did. Do you enjoy exercise? <laughs> I actually do. I, I do. I laugh, but I actually really do. It's therapeutic, right? It is. In the last couple of months, I've been going through, I feel like, a lot of uh, slopes. Dan would be like, are you depressed? I don't say it like that. I no, say, hey, no, he like, he's, are you okay? No. <laughs> if you need me, I'm here. You can talk. <laughs> you know, he's great. <laughs> um, <laughs> Gosh. Um, no, 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 no. He's, he's very kind. Um, so I've been able to... <laughs> <laughs> Doing exercise definitely helped me mentally. I feel like I'm way, way better place. I get low a lot less, which is, which is good. I'm also training for the Spartan race, <laughs> which is, ooh, make sure to tune in for that one. But no, exercise, I, I really enjoy it. Um, what about you? Yeah, yeah, I enjoy it. I enjoy the, I enjoy yeah. sports. We have a little gym here, so that's kind of fun. Mm -hmm. You know, a good time to, to go clear your head and burn stress. And yeah, it's, it's fun. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. He also wanted to say something. It's been a while. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Dan had to go take care of Carter because he was getting uh, a little annoyed. But thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions for us, please post them down below and we will do a video to answer you. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and we will see you in the next video.